Warning, the following video contains... Spoilers. Of course you probably worked that one out for yourself. Low resolution models and textures. That would not look out of place in Minecraft. What do you expect? This game's almost as old as I am. Animal attacks. Animal death. And... Commentary recorded in my voice. Also, the game featured in this video has an age rating of... Peggy 12. If you are under this age, or think you are likely to be adversely affected by any of the aforementioned content, I advise you to stop watching this video. Now, let's get this game started. Okay, so, one door left. Yeah, let me just check which symbols correspond to which switches on this door. Okay, so yeah. So I think the one at the end needs to be up. <coughs> so yeah, this one needs to be up, I think. And this one needs to be down. And then the one at the other end, I don't know because it's... Oh. I do now. <coughs> oh, and there's stuff on top of that as well. I'll get, I'll get that one, so done the puzzle inside here. Assuming there is a puzzle and not just something that wants to eat me. Well this certainly looks puzzling. Well, well. Up or down? I'm going to hell sooner or later anyway. So I might as well pay a visit. Oh, I get it. I mean, seriously, Lara must have some muscles on her because I think I just pulled that out from underneath the pillar. Yeah. Like I said. I mean, good lord, Lara. How often do you work out? Because I really need to take up your training regime.
Okay. Yeah, I think if I jump to there. Difficult to get a read on it when it's when the camera is not operating properly. Ooh, nearly too far. Dear. Born at the last hurdle. Okay, let's try that again, shall we? <coughs> ah, much better. stuff down there. I have to remember to uh, to get that. And there's bats, so I'm switching to these. Okay, I think that was all the bats. In fact, really, I should be conser since I'm safe here. I should be conserving ammo by shooting them with these anyway. Come on, come and get it. Takes care of him. I think there's still one down there, though. Oh, I know where I am. Yes, this is above where I was before. I'm assuming that's the one that's down there rather than the one rather than anything up here. Okay. The only way I can think to get to those is to drop down there. And I don't think I can get back up here after doing that, so... I think I'll leave that until I've worked out what I'm doing up here. Maybe I should be swimming. Rather than running around on top where I could easily fall off the edge. Right. 
Don't see anything here, so... Ah! Of course there's a crocodile in here. Why wouldn't there be? Get back here. Put your guns away now. Oh, come on. I think there might be two of them back there. I also think my best bet of getting either of them might be to draw them out. Get out of the water now. Oh yeah, there are two of them. Oops. One down. Come on, come and get me. I'm going to regret this. And here it comes. Don't go backwards, go forwards. And that thing had less health than I thought it did. Hopefully it was just the two of them. I'm just going to slide off that, aren't I? Yeah. Nope, can't climb up there. So yeah, gonna have to go up over there. So yeah, I think we've got to jump over that. Not helpful. I'm 
just noticed something. That floor, the ceiling, I mean, above me, is uh, looks as it gives out. I wonder how I get up there. Hmm. Yes, made it. Now to get down here. Oh, apparently these are a secret. Okay then. So, I take it that, that means there's no other reason to be back here. So, you know, in a more modern game, I think that the pattern on the opposite wall meant something. In this game, I'm not so sure. I reckon I could just drop down there. Question is, would that work? To get me any closer to what I, where I want to be? These are a secret too. Okay. I'm pretty sure there's still a gorilla running around on the other side of this, so... Okay then. Sometimes I think I'm wasting my time looking in every nook and cranny. And then I find something like this just now. And it makes it all worthwhile. Okay. But I think I've got to jump over there now. And hopefully not get ripped to shreds like this. One shot. Maybe I should be letting the uh, animals get closer to me rather than trying to keep my distance from them. 
it's a good thing it I killed that one in one shot because I immediately pressed the space bar to put the gun away by accident. Okay, I'm assuming it's a case of just jumping straight across there, or more accurately, running, jumping, and grabbing a ledge. But I think we all know what's going to happen if I misjudge it somehow. Or just let go of the button that's that I'm supposed to hold to hold on to a ledge. I think that's all of them. Okay. This feels like a sort of tight enclosed space where I'll get attacked. Maybe I'm just being paranoid. Again. Oh. And that's the floor that I was looking at earlier. Okay then. I want to jump oh I want to get over there to that med path. Fingers crossed. Now I reckon I can make it there just by running. Yep. And assuming I'm meant to go back the way I came, I can just fall down there and uh, swim back. On the other hand, maybe I'm not meant to go back the way I came. Oh, 
wish you wouldn't do that. Closer. What's say we take a leisurely stroll around here so I don't fall off and have to... Well, I mean, it's not that long since I saved it, actually. I was thinking I might have to run all the way around again, but like I can say I saved it. Not the direction I wanted you to jump in. Actually, I didn't want you to jump at all. And I see a crocodile's tail moving away from me in that direction. Yeah, let's pick up here. So, do we think it's better to tr to stay here and try to shoot it when it comes this way, or jump in to lure it somewhere? I mean, is there a bigger pool at the other end of this that I that would find it easier to shoot it from? Well, like I keep saying, I've just saved it, so... It's not like I'm risking much by... going for a swim. Well, I wouldn't call this pool bigger, but since I... Not backwards, forwards! I'll take care of that. Why do you always move backwards just as you come to the surface? I'm just going everywhere that I've already been, just from a higher elevation, aren't I? And I hear lions growling. I do hope those are down there, rather than up here. Yep, they are. I think I'll just uh, shoot them now to avoid Assuming they come somewhere I can shoot them.
is it's such a large area they could run around in that I can't be sure that they're going to come back anytime soon. Well, I've, I've wounded them, so it won't be as hard to beat them in the future. Nothing else up here, is there? Yeah, I've got all three lead bars now. So... I think I'm supposed to go down here. Well, I mean, why else would they put lions there to, uh, to attack me? I don't trust myself not to get hurt with a drop from here. Huh. Not as uh, big a drop as I thought, clearly. Hmm. Come on. Where are you? Well, they certainly were in quite a distance, didn't they? I wonder whether I've missed something that's supposed to open that gate. Or was that just a dead end? Yeah, that might just be a dead end, actually. And this, this gate doesn't do anything. Except make you wonder. And here we are, back at the feet of Midas. I don't freeze on me now. Oh. Okay, so it didn't freeze on me, it's just I had to push the button twice. I would like to give you a better angle on that, but apparently I can't move the camera. Yeah. Yeah, there's just, there's no way to actually watch it happening. Apparently.
And of course the ceiling's too low there for me to jump off the jump backwards off the ledge. But you're not gonna get much sun down here to tell what time it is. Right, before I forget, there's a couple of items up there and a large med pack up there somewhere that I need to uh, try and work out how to get to. Well, I mean, getting to, getting to those first items isn't hard. So I think I really know what I'm doing to get to them. Yeah, that was easy enough. Is it there? Hmm. Maybe I'm overthinking this. Maybe it is just as simple as getting there and jumping up. <coughs> Need to check this anyway. Yeah, the ones on either side. And I wasn't very much mistaken. Yeah, that door's open now. Good. Yeah, see, I know there's a, a large med pack up there, but how am I supposed to get up there?
What am I missing? Well, that wasn't what I meant to do. Oh well. Okay, so I've had a look at the Tomb Raider wiki now to see how to get up there to that large med pack. And apparently the only way to do it is to cheat. Um, by using what is known as the corner bug. Which means that you have to stand, I think it's roughly about here, and then just keep jumping on the spot. It says that if you keep on doing that, eventually she'll just um, pop up to the top of this this uh, column. Hopefully I'm doing this right. Right, yeah, that's... I think that's more like it. Might screw it up a bit there. You see how she's starting to clip into the wall there, That's that shows that this uh, corner bug is working. Oh yeah, I was, I was definitely doing it wrong when I first started out. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, so apparently that is the only way to get up here to get this. And I'm pretty sure that this is the end of the level once I've uh, put these golden bars into these sockets. Wrong button. Yeah, like I say, I think this is the end of the level. And bearing in mind the floor slopes away like that, I'm definitely not coming back from there, so... Geronimo!
wow, an hour and a half. I mean, I'm not surprised, but yeah. <laughs> Thank you for watching everyone. If you enjoyed this video, give it a pause up with that like in button, howl at me in the comments, and if you'd like to be a part of my pack, consider clicking the subscribe moon which is orbiting on screen somewhere now.